As we discussed in the previous video, how to achieve and maintain a sterile field, we are now ready for Foley Catherine's searching for both male and female patients. But before we start, let's check important points using this checklist. First, we're going to verify the physician's orders. Second, we have to always confirm the patient identity. Three, check for allergies, especially to latex and iodine. Four, make sure your supplies are all gathered. And then five, we want a good working height, so position the bed to a proper height. Six, check the contents list on the package before starting. Seven, keep the catheter in its wrapper until insertion. Eight, don't forget to grab a catheter securing device. Nine, always have extra sterile gloves available. Ask for assistance during the procedure. Now that we have all of our things, we're going to start the insertion process. For male patients, prepare the site using betadine and cotton swabs. Hold the penis at a 90 degree angle. If the male patient is uncircumcised, be sure to pull by fold of the foreskin. In a circular motion, use the first swab to clean the urine amiatus, all the way down to the base of the shaft. Repeat the same step using the second and third swab. Step number two, insert the catheter into the lubricant packing to ensure that the end of the catheter is fully lubricated. Diffusing anesthetic lubricant, wait three minutes. Then we're ready to insert the catheter. Press the tube five inches from the tip. Ask the patient to hold their breath or prostrum the Valsalva maneuver or air down, then insert. By holding it with a one hand to hold the penis steady and using the other to feed, you can easily insert the catheter with the patient bearing down. Once the catheter is inserted, we will then inflate the balloon. Be sure to insert. When you see return, pull back a little bit, and then you're ready to inflate the balloon. Make sure you follow the packaging. Realize if it's 16FR 10cc, well then you would use 10cc's for the balloon. So once you insert the balloon, the catheter is patent and draining. You'll attach the Foley bag or leg bag and come back in a few minutes to make sure it's draining. Then for female patients, We'll use the same thing with the cotton swabs and beta done. However, with the cotton swabs, we're going to go through the labia majora, left and right. And then through the mill with the last swab. Then we will insert the catheter. We're going to compress the catheter tubing five inches from the tip. Ask the patient to bear down. And then insert. We're going to advance two to three inches until urine appears. When urine appears, advance a little bit more and then patent it. Hold it steady and inflate the balloon. Use your non damaged hand, hold the catheter, then inflate the balloon. Give the catheter a nice little pull to see if it's placed. Now, it is important to remember these little steps for performing both procedures. Always remember when it's finished and draining and patented to secure the catheter. Maybe using a stereo lock device or a catheter leg band in order to keep the catheter steady. Two, position the drainage bag below the bladder level, so always attach it to the bottom of the bed and make sure to use a privacy bag. Three, always check for kinks. And four is to always document the procedure. Thanks for watching. If you found this video useful, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe for more medical information and to really help you on your next exam.